Yo, what's going on guys? I just wanted to make a quick little video here showing the setup process for the Get More RAM app and Mellow NX. Um, I've had some people ask me about this and the process is just a little bit different uh, compared to some of the other emulators you might have set up on your iPhone. So let's go ahead and get started with this. All right, guys. So the first step we're going to take here, uh, I have these two websites linked in the description below. You're going to first get the Mellow NX IPA file. You're going to scroll down here, go to releases, and then the IPA file is right here. Go ahead and download that. Then go ahead to the Get More RAM GitHub page. We're going to scroll down here. By the way, if you want to do this without watching the video, um, just follow the instructions they have here. It's really not too hard. Go to assets and entitlement.ipa. That's what we're going to get. Okay. Now what we're going to want to do is go to side store, go there to the plus button. We're going to sideload get more RAM first. Okay. Then we're going to sideload mellow NX. Okay. So now what we're going to do is go into the get more RAM app right here, go into settings. And it's going to have you sign in with the same ID that you used for side store. So I'll go ahead and do that now. Okay. I've gone ahead and signed in. So we'll go to app IDs now. Press refresh. And you should see the Mellow NX right here. Click add increased memory limit. And once you see that, we should be good. So go back over to side store. Let's... Uh, Sorry, we'll go to, you're basically going to uninstall Mellow NX. Then go back into side store and sideload Mellow NX once more. Okay, now we're going to open Mellow NX. We're going to import our keys. And I just have them dumped from a modded switch and they are right here. I'm not going to be going over how to get those. Again, you need to dump them from a modded switch, and that's a whole other topic. We've got our firmware zip file. It will crash the first time usually, but that's fine. Just open it back up. You'll see it's finished it there. And if we go to our settings, you'll see here, increased memory limit is enabled. If it says disabled for some reason, then you did something wrong. But if it says enabled, that means that it can access the full amount of RAM that it is needing for this app. Now we can go in here to stick debug, launch Mellow NX, and you can see JIT enabled with the memory limit increased. So there you go. If you were wondering how to set this emulator up and were confused, it's pretty straightforward. If you have any questions, please let me know but I appreciate you watching.